Welcome to the Ava Family Farmer. Your device has finally arrived. Are you ready to get growing? Start by unboxing the Ava Byte and reading the instruction manuals back to front. Download the Ava Byte app from the App Store and follow along with the app instructions. Check and make sure all your components are laid out. You will have your Ava Byte, your pod pack, your pod holders, domes, power adapter, and instruction manual in the box. Start by taking your power adapter and plugging in the small end into the back of the bike. Then put the plug into the nearest wall socket. Wait for your device to be fully turned on. The bite will start pulsing white and you'll know that you're ready to start the pairing process. Type in your network name, password, and security type. This part might look different if you have an Android. You will receive a pop-up which will be explained in the app. Touch and hold the circular button at the top of the Avabyte light panel for two seconds. You'll feel the button vibrate and start to pulse yellow. Go to your Wi-Fi settings and wait a few moments until you see the Avabyte network pop up. Choose that network and return back to the Avabyte app. When you see the green light, that means your byte is now connected. Wait a few moments and your byte will pair with the Wi-Fi network. Now your byte will complete a firmware update. Once your garden is named, set your lighting schedule. Once you've selected this time, it cannot be changed, so choose a time that works best for you. Select your permissions. Make sure that you keep your push notifications on to receive updates on your harvest and when to fill up your reservoir with water. The camera permissions here give access to your camera so you can scan the QR code found at the back of your pod pack. Finally, it is time to add some water. Fill with 12 to 14 cups or 2.8 to 3.4 liters of water, or take out the top tray and fill to the max fill line in the reservoir. If your pump is correctly connected, you will receive a blue light once the water is filled. If your device is pulsing blue, that means that you have not added enough water. The device will go red if the reservoir is overfilled. If your light is pulsing orange, that means there's a pump connection error. All you have to do to fix this is go to your pump and push it down a little. Take your pod pack and find the QR code on the back of the box. Make sure that your app is open and scan your pod pack so that your garden knows what you are growing. Now it is time to assemble your pods. Take your pod holders and place a pod into each holder. You will notice a sticker on the top of the pod. Pull off the tab that says pull and leave the rest of the sticker on the pod. This will help you know what you're growing. Cover the pods with the germination domes. You're all set, farmer. Get ready to watch your tiny plants grow. If you have any questions, try asking your smart home device or check the app for updates. The rest of the hard work is on us.